Okay, let's go see Alistair and see what's going on. It's been a while since we've seen him. Uh, in my uh, story or whatever you want to call it, Alistair is the king. And uh, I think we can. Hey, he's not in the chantry, is he? Hmm. Where would he be? He's in the keep. Yeah, the Viscount keep. Let me guess. That's your final answer? Three mages have fled to Ferelden, and you have intervened to protect them, as if it is your right to do so. What other answer did you expect, your majesty? A maybe might have been nice. I do not deal in maybes. I deal in cold, hard facts, as should you. Perhaps when Ferelden next chooses a king, it will be one that takes his duty to the Maker seriously. Ooh, harsh words. Well, that was awkward. <laughs> That's just Meredith's idea of Kirkwall hospitality. Really? Kirkwall brutality? You must rip the skin off your face, then. This is the champion of Kirkwall. Right, I'm Alistair. Oh, uh, uh, King of Ferelden. And this is Tegan. My uncle. Sort of. I'm actually Tegan. I'm only sort of his uncle. <laughs> Your Majesty, may I say what an honor it is to meet you? Well, you could, but you'd be the first today. I fought at Ostagar. What happened there was a great tragedy. Ah, uh, yes, it was. Sadly, Loghain still lives. Say, weren't you a Grey Warden once? That's the rumor. Wait. Weren't you? That's the rumor. Huh. I guess we get around. I was hoping we could talk. Would have been better timing before being emasculated by Meredith, but I'm not picky. <laughs> Things are looking up. It's not often I get called on to meet with foreign leaders. I know you came here from Lothering. A Ferelden refugee that did well for herself. Against all odds. I have to admit, I was hoping your influence in Kirkwall might be of use. Things haven't been going well with Orlay. Without a Viscount here, however, there's only the Knight Commander to deal with. Hmm. What do you need me to do? Sadly, it may be too late. Meredith got wind of my arrival sooner than I'd hoped. What you can do is protect Kirkwall. It will take someone like you to keep it from falling apart. Just me standing between the city and disaster, huh? <laughs> I've been there. Trust me, it isn't pretty. Well, I suppose we should be getting back. We should. The hero of Ferelden should be back in Denerim by now. You're always so formal. He has a name, you know. Okay, that was fun to see a uh, blast from the past, as it were. So, what else is here? Aveline's office, favor and faults. Is that companion? Oil and oil? That one never. Is that companion thing? Mm. It is. Okay, it's let's old. do it. This is past time for joking. I'm helping you indulge in a lab. Back to the barracks. I never tire of it. Meredith will die. Do not doubt that. Oh, go away, just You have no Viscount. It's clear you're suffering without sufficient leadership. That doesn't grant default authority to you or your commander. It would be easier if you cooperated. Wouldn't it? Guard, Captain. Trouble? Yes. He's been hounding me. These Templars strut around as it is, but now it's just... out of hand. He could be fishing for a less strenuous position here in the barracks. Well, he won't be getting one from me. That's not what Cullen has heard. What are you talking about? 
that you coddle your men. It's all lies, of course, but it's out there. No wonder the lieutenant was harassing me. Bastards. If they think I'm coddling anyone, it'll be my husband, Donnick. You and I will intercept his patrol tonight. Then you can see for yourself if I'm coddling him, or any in my command. Hmm. I don't have to see proof. I already believe you. Of course you do. But nobody questions my leadership without a response. Cullum wants to know if these things are true. You'll be able to tell him. Donick's patrol, Hawk. Me and you, tonight. Accuse me of being soft. Not in this lifetime. <laughs> you are no fun. Okay. <clears throat> nice little mission there. Where else do we go? There's a couple of more things we need to tie up. Uh, let's get out of here. Nothing more to do here. Uh, let's see. Closure, Varric and Lowtown Hangman's Pub. Head to Merrill at a house in the Alienage. Because the secondary is like crap. Yeah. I suppose I could do the hair blessed one real quick. Go to the gallows. How do we handle hand in the uh, the herbalist tasks? Can't remember where I picked it up, man. That's the Templar Hall. Uh, I don't need that. Ah, here we go. Sofitos. Welcome back, my friend. My store has never been better stocked thanks to you. Although I have nothing else to ask you to find, you're quite welcome to bring back any rare specimens you may come across. I'd be more than happy to craft something just for you. It's the least I can do for the champion of Kirkwall. I took this fire gland from a high dragon just outside the city. You killed a high dragon? Incredible. Let me see the fire gland. It was either her life or mine. I chose mine. And that I am glad to hear. This fire gland is a remarkable specimen. Wait here. I know exactly what I can craft from this. This turned out beautifully. Something worthy of our champion. I hope you can put it to good use. Oh, that's nice. Looks like our business is concluded mm. for the moment. Intriguing. Um, maybe get some potions while we're here. Uh, let's see. A lot of junk. Yeah, we got the tooth. That's pretty good. So good to see you, champion. Yeah. Let's see, potions. So good to see you, champion. There we go. Bags are plenty. Right, so we tied that up. Good, good. I don't want to do the uh the the mission there just yet. I do want to do, let's do closure with Varric. I think this is one of the, looks like one of the last ones of Varric, so. Mm -hmm. Let's go to the hangman. You're doing that nervous twitchy thing again, Hawk. Don't worry. I'll be careful with the shard. 
You of all people know I'm trustworthy. Back in Bartrand's house, you seemed... not quite yourself. I think getting out of that house cleared my head. I feel fine now. What are you having? Edwina, let's get a couple of drinks here. Mm -hmm. So that was over fairly quickly. <laughs> Let's head on out. So, next is Meryl, I think. Let's see how she's doing. Lethalan, I need to ask something of you. I thought the Arulin home would be the last thing I needed, but the Illuvian still won't work. I think... I think I have to go back to the... spirit that helped me at the start of all this. Ooh. <laughs> Nothing bad ever comes from summoning demons. That's why, why I need you to come with me. I've called to the spirit, but he doesn't seem to hear. He was sealed in an artifact on Sundermount. I have to look for him there. But if things go wrong, if he possesses me, I need you to strike me down. You would risk becoming an abomination for this mirror. How is it worth that? Marvinan, you of all people should understand. I would gladly sacrifice my life to help my people. There's no one else I trust. Please, Marvinan. I don't want to go into this alone. If you're determined to do this, then I'll come with you to make sure nothing goes wrong. Ah, Saranas. You've no idea what a relief that is. The demon is sealed in a cave on Sundermount. The sooner we get this over with, the better. Okay, Sundermount, eh? Something tells me I need to choose my group carefully for this mission. So... Meryl... And... Anders, I think, would be best. <clears throat> Although it doesn't give me a tank, that's the problem. Hmm. Oh, well, we'll just have to manage without. Because I don't think any one of those would approve of what we're doing. I think they'd be very um, skeptical and uh, kind of not happy that we're doing this. Oh, what's this? Oh, nice. Some money I left earlier. You should have this back. Twine? When did I loan you a ball of twine? You gave it to me when I first moved here when I kept getting lost in Lowtown. It drove the merchants in the market completely batty, but it did help me find my way. Keep it, Daisy. Okay. And with you in ability wise, well, she's. Certainly got things going on. Yeah, she's pretty much maxed out, Pariah. So I don't think I'll be getting lost again anytime soon. Well, you never know. Might need to uh, tie a package up, hang a lantern, dress a roast chicken. It's multi purpose. Here goes nothing, I think it's not far now. It's just up the hill here. I don't know why I'm bothering. Hopefully I've got enough potions and realize this is crazy, right? Believe me, I noticed. If I had any other choices, I'd take them. You have choices. You always had choices. 
Stop using blood magic. Get rid of that damned mirror. Oh, in that case, I'll head back to Kirkwall and throw it away. Right after you abandon the plight of the Circle of Mages. He's been a bit hypocritical. Oh, hello. Oh, lovely. Look what I've just walked into. Isn't that nice? Anyone thing to do with spiders? Set them on fire. Here's the passage. Let's have to get Farrick in on the deal. Quick. Have to go. Better have him take the lead just in case. Might be some trippy trappies. No, just more bugs. Shadow Warrior. This is the problem with having squishy people. I had them on hold there. <laughs> it's a bit silly. I must have pressed H by accident. Anything up here? Just the skilly. Hmm. Dead end. Interesting. Wasn't expecting that. There's a uh, no. There's a secret lever or something. I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, well, this is a nice dead end. <laughs> We're supposed to be able to get through here. Ah, there's the thing on the right here. Here we go. Ah. That's really bad. That doesn't look like you can get through there. Oh. It's set me through the passage already. Let's just loot all these lovely graves, shall we? Some nice stuff here. I wonder if any can be used. I 
Je me paye un cœur. Might be a good build for us, actually. Yeah. I think there's anything. Uh, that might be okay. Companion armor. That's not very good, is it? Uh, let's see. Robes of the champion. Just robes of the overseer would be good, but we can't have that. Yeah, enough of messing around. Let's go. else get the feeling that this is going to end badly just me huh it's not all bad Varric. think of the story <laughs> i could live without telling anyone we murdered you on some mountainside it's a little hard to make that one sound good oh that's a lot of dragons Yeah. Oh, drop the Jade Serpent. Attack. Oh, that'd be good for Varric. 33 attack. That'll do nicely. thought putting a demon in a cave on Sundermount was a good idea in the first place. Where would you have put him? To Vinter, maybe? Or in the Anderfells? Further away from Kirkwall, that's for sure. <laughs> Turn ahead inside and see what's in Pride's End.
something is wrong. This is where the spirit was bound. But now it feels... empty. How are we going to finish the mirror now? I don't know. I don't understand what's happened. How can he be gone? I... haven't. Keeper. What have you done? The demon's plan was always for you to complete the mirror. It would have been a doorway out of this prison and into our world. You would have been his first victim. I couldn't let that happen, Dalen. Hmm. You didn't think to mention that the demon was gone before we hiked all the way up here. It's not gone. I couldn't fight it in the Fade while it was trapped. And I couldn't banish it without making it stronger. So, I made myself its prison. Kill me, and it dies too. Meryl will finally be safe. No! You can't ask the... I won't do this! You always knew your blood magic had a price, Darlene. I have chosen to pay it for you. Daughter, she... Traitor! May the dream... That will punch you for the rest of your days. Very demon move. Let's go with them. Don't call the dogs. They built my life. Why did you have to come back and destroy it? Where? The whole class. And you... Certainly full of himself. Can harbor that tank, but with all the armor, let's get some lightning on this sucker. Let's leave this awful place. The clan should hear the good news. Hmm. No, this seems too easy. You told us that the demon was bound to your life. It would only die with you. Irabalas Keeper. What have you done? 
I don't want this. I never wanted this. Creators, please let this be a bad dream. I'll wake up and feel like an idiot and she'll scold me for not listening. Mm. Getting possessed never helps anything. Tell me about it. If she hadn't have been so stubborn, if she had listened to me, she never believed in me. I... I should go to the clan. Someone needs to know, needs to come. Take care of her. Okay. Not sure why I got rivalry with Anders, but whatever, it doesn't matter. We know the Keeper came here. What's going on? Where is she? At Stabba. Feneral. The Keeper. She. Look at her, Feneral. She's covered in blood. What have you done, Meryl? Keeper? Can you hear me? She's dead. I should have guessed you'd turn on her. You monster. Hmm. This was a tragedy. I promise you, I'll make sure no one else is hurt by Meryl's blood magic. You expect us to take the word of a Shemlin? Stand down, Anaria. She was our first once. The Keeper loved her. More than she loved the clan, it seems. Feneral, I'm sorry. I never wanted this. If I could have saved her, if I could have died instead, I would have. Words are cheap. That you're still breathing says enough. Enough, Anaria. Human, take Meryl away from here. Okay. And that, as he says that, yeah. Uh, Forgive me. If you weren't here, Hawk, they'd kill me. Yeah, there wasn't much we could do about that. I mean, I don't want to fight with the dealers. <laughs> so, not much to be said about that, really. It's a sad outcome, eh? <laughs> I don't think you, you could get a positive outcome out of that, really, because when there's Have demons, I it's... Have mentioned that I like your court? You do? It's very lively, like a crow in the middle of hunting. That's... that's great. Thanks, Meryl. <laughs> I tried to warn you, Blondie. You're not helping. So next up is to do the thing with Aveline and then we can carry on with the main plot and we'll do that next time guys. See you then.